Whopper diet and why I think it's the shortcut to enlightenment. When you're on the Whopper diet, your 50 trillion cells are getting a new frequency because the live food is energy and your cells have energy, your body is pulsing at a frequency and when your cells, your 50 trillion cells get clean, your senses are different. You, you send clear messages to your brain. What is the shortcut to enlightenment? It is the Wapu diet. That has been my experience with it. Because it, the live food, the live enzymes that are in raw vegetables and raw fruit go into your 50 trillion cells and they pulse with your cells. They have a frequency. Your body is more of a magnetic field, an electric magnetic field, than it is a physical body. And you're, when your cells become clean, this, the nerves to your brain send clear messages to your brain. Your senses are more finite, clear, and you can pick up reality, all of it, which is not only the physical reality, the reality on earth, but all this sort of frequency feeling, sort of like ethereal, electromagnetic waves, which is what we are, we're pulsing at, the communication is different. You feel super happy, excited, can't wait to wake up, you're very creative, you feel like um, doing things you've never done, you have tons of energy, and then when you eat the cooked food, you're eating dead food that doesn't have this pulse frequency. And, you know, there's some people that are theorizing that the chimpanzees became humans, the homo sapiens, because they learned how to prepare fire and cook meat. But there's no empirical evidence that this is the reason why we have the brains we do. We don't have, they just make this up. And now we found out that when you grill your meat and it's well done, it's actually carcinogenic. So we have a conflict here of beliefs. And what you believe, you make your reality. And so this is a pretty big problem. Because when you're introduced to the well food diet, you're very concerned with protein. You're saying, oh my gosh, I need to eat meat. That's why we have these brains we have. But there's no evidence that that's the case. And the live foods have protein in them. An avocado has eight grams of protein. The almonds have protein. Your leaves have protein. Everything has protein. On the raw food diet, you don't need as much protein because it's all being used perfectly and safely. And it's cleaning out your cells. The chlorophyll in the leaves is sucking out the toxins. And you're having different senses. And these senses are giving you an experience of reality, much like the definition of enlightenment, which is feeling one, not only with the earth reality, the physical reality, but you feel connected to all of it. The ocean, the sand, uh, you pick up telepathy, you pick up, and also these incredible, exciting moments occur that don't happen when I eat cooked food. It's almost like there might be a connection between our thoughts, our senses, feeling great, and how we see the world. When you feel better, and you feel beautiful, and you feel excited, and you feel incredible, and everything feels great, your reality is different. And that's what I would call the shortcut to enlightenment. The way to experience this is to try the raw food diet for one weekend. And my YouTubes will teach you what to eat, and you want to stay 100% raw. This is why the sages like Buddha and Jesus and all the famous avatars talked about fasting. They knew this secret.